Yo guys, what up? Welcome back to Judas Z and today we're gonna get a bit caught up with the freaking new uh, stuff in game. We just got a server patch which pretty much uh, just uh, tell, uh, told us that we got some text fixed uh, but they accidentally showed uh, Captain America's uh, freaking portrait here and the icon in game and that's why they had to add this part in here and um, that means that probably that patch which was like 15 megabytes uh, big uh, that patch probably has all the data that we need for the new uh, changes to the uniforms for Captain America um, Iron Man I guess and maybe Thor hopefully I really don't know or maybe Hulk I really don't know man I want them to be really good all of them uh, but anyway that's it for the freaking server patch thing let's check out the freaking uh, quest package pretty much what this is is the same thing that we get for every event that uh, they hold where if you buy $30 of uh, crystals and some bios and north stones you also get some uh, event tokens that you can uh, also use uh, for stuff in the event uh, shop and also the uh, second quest package uh, costs like $80 and you get a lot more here and if you're a total freaking whale you can buy both of them or you can just buy this one uh, a lot of times because look at this the purchase limit is three times so you can buy both of them for like three times uh, but yeah seriously we're not whales we cannot do that uh, let's move on now we have the freaking uh, special uh, event that we got now and they say greetings agents this is CM fragment of Marvel Future Fight team in celebration of the uh, new Spider-Man contents in Marvel Future Fight we will be holding the Spider-Man special event where you can get rewarded by simply logging into the game with a check-in event and accomplishing simple tasks don't miss out on the rewards that uh, can definitely help speed up your character's growth you can even earn a 6 star mega rank up because, oh wow this is actually new to me I, I freaking didn't know this whoa ho, ho. this is actually good uh, through the event quest for your event tokens along with various tier, uh, various tier 2 and tier 3 growth materials the more you invest in your character's growth the more rewards you can receive with the gold bonus mission so that's pretty cool and then they just say make sure to check the event quest missions list for uh, more details, uh, details below and that's actually a pretty cool picture of Spidey a uh, little Spidey boy uh, now we have the period here it will be up for uh, 10 days which is pretty great I guess The because uh, we get like 50 tokens right yeah we get 50 tokens and that means we'll have 500 tokens in total at the end of the event which means we can get the 6 star mega rank up ticket which is amazing anyway uh, the missions that we will need to do uh, daily would be clearing dimension rifts for 10 times uh, participating in timeline battle 5 times clearing villain siege at least once and then enhancing an ISO it said one time and enhancing a comic card one time which are pretty easy stuff to do I really don't like the uh, missions where we help uh, to use energy but whatever uh, dimensional rifts are better than uh, when we are required to do story missions because those are actually worse uh, they don't guarantee that you will get the bio so I usually never do them but whatever we're getting dimensional rift uh, as a mission so that's a bit better you can use cards at least to uh, level them up and use them as materials and stuff like that but anyway uh, this is the list of uh, items that we would get uh, let's start from the bottom we have the 7 million and 500 K gold which can only be bought by whales because you'll have to pay uh, one of those uh, packages if you want to get more than 500 K tokens uh, to be able to buy this so this is a whale item pretty much every item here is a whale item uh, except for this one because uh, freaking play, uh, players should get this one and also freaking veterans should get this as well because those are really rare and are pretty much the best uh, ticket that we have in game because you can use them on freaking premium characters but yeah 
What I mean by the fact that I say that uh, every other item in here is a premium, uh, is a whale uh, type of item, uh, it, it's not that they are really a lot better than this one, but it's that uh, if you were uh, if you were to be freaking sane and not crazy, you would go for the six star mega rank up ticket. The only case where you would want to go with uh, these other stuff would be if you had uh, 500 uh, tokens and probably bought more tokens on the freaking quest packs and uh, then you'll have more freaking uh, tokens to spend and get more items so that's what I mean definitely only go for this one right here that's uh, the best one there's nothing better than that uh, that you can get from this uh, event quest uh, shop now we have the gold bonus mission it will start today as well and it will go for like six days which is pretty cool i guess we will have to spend like 20 uh, million gold which is pretty okay i guess it's not that expensive uh but uh the rewards aren't that great uh the best things here are the 100 energy and 100 uh freaking bios which i'll definitely use for molten man because i still have him at tier one and I still haven't even gotten him to six stars. I, I want to at least get him to six stars and then uh, worry about uh, getting him to tier two. But at least we get like 300 uh, from uh, the last check in that we had till now. And 100 from this, I would be like uh, 400 and maybe like 225 from Shadowland this week. Uh, that's gonna be like 600 bios. That's gonna be pretty great. <laughs> Thank you very much uh, But anyway, uh, then we have the freaking uh, platinum box uh, Which will be available from like three days from now, which is pretty okay I guess but definitely I'll be getting BAM. That's for sure That's what, what I always get and lastly we have the seven day check-in event which will run for uh, It will start Four days from now which uh, is kind of weird I thought it would start uh, today uh, but whatever and uh, it will run for like 10 days as well so even if you start like three days later you can still get these because uh, you only uh, have to get in game for like seven days but this runs for 10 days so you have like three days uh, available for uh, available wow I cannot speak because I haven't had a lot of sleep these two days uh, but whatever, never mind. I sleep like a drunk when when I can when I haven't slept well. Uh, but what I meant is that we have like three days available to us for us to miss uh, checking in the game and uh, not getting the rewards. But definitely do not miss any day in this game. This game is so good. <laughs> I mean, it's kind of bad in a way, but I love it so much. I really don't care what uh, Net Marble does. Uh, up to a point, because if it gets to a point where it hurts uh, new players, I will speak out uh, speak out about it, uh, about it. Uh, but yeah, anyway, uh, let me just show a couple, uh, well not a couple, just a picture of the freaking uh, uh, new cap icon, let me go in here, there you go, we're in game buddy, we're in game, hey hello Spidey, you suck. I really love this new change where the uniform will just start rotating slowly like that. It's not me that is moving it, uh, it just moves on its own. But anyway, let's go ahead and check out Cap's uh, new icon, which pretty much uh, messed up the plans for uh, Marble because they didn't want people to know. They thought they were being slick. And that's what happens when we have the uh, freaking. Uh, helmet on I cannot freaking find him because he looks like almost everybody else here uh, but seriously I, I really kind of liked this look a bit better if he had the freaking uh, Mjolnir hammer uh, here I wouldn't mind but whatever uh, it's uh, it's good that they're trying to be authentic with the freaking uniforms uh, so they don't freaking uh, mess uh, stuff up uh, do we still have the uh, zero? Yeah, zero crystals. Let me unequip this because I equipped it just for a freaking um, mission uh, for the uh, academy missions where you get uh, crystals, but I really didn't need that to be there. Uh, let me see if I have one on Gene because I think I had one. On nope, I don't. Okay, so that's good. 
Uh, but anyway, guys, what I'm, I wanted to do for the uh, giveaway would be that uh, I would want to ask you if you actually liked the look without the uh, helmet or the look with the helmet better. Uh, personally, I would go with the look without the helmet, or at least if it uh, needs to have the uh, helmet, I would just ask for them to give him the moment where he had the uh, helmet torn up, and that actually looked really freaking cool. And apart from that, I really want uh, want you to tell me if you uh, want him to have energy damage as well. But. Personally, uh, I would not uh, want any of his skills to read energy here because that would really mess him up against Proxima. It will lower his, his damage immensely because she doesn't get uh, damaged by energy hits. And uh, apart from that, there's also uh, the fact that even if they keep this as physical and give, uh, give him energy damage uh, uh, to one, of, one or two of his skills, I really want it to be... Uh, freaking uh, what do I say I really want it to be on top of the normal damage so it's not like they uh, make they're making him a, a kind of a hybrid just like uh, genies for example some of her skills are mind damage some of her, her skills are energy damage so her damage is kind of lower against the uh, uh, Colobsidian but uh, yeah, I really don't want them to do that. If they actually add, him, uh, add some energy damage to him, I, uh, I really want it to be on top of the damage that he already has. I don't want him to suffer. Uh, lastly, before I end, uh, I think what they could do with the skill, at least with one of the skills, uh, would be... And it's actually almost freaking perfect, as if they kinda knew what would happen, but I really don't think they did. Maybe they did, but didn't have enough time to do it. Uh, I think the fourth skill, the way it looks like uh, right here, could be uh, worked on with the uh, freaking Mjolnir on top. If what they could do is either replace the shield uh, with the hammer, and it's actually the hammer which is uh, actually hitting around uh, all the enemies, or they could keep this uh, skill animation with the uh, freaking shield being thrown around. But instead of uh, him just uh, throwing it and it bouncing around, I, I would love to see him uh, just uh, hitting it with a hammer just like he did in the movie, but that's just me. Anyway, if you want to win, uh, just uh, follow the rules, which means uh, be subscribed and also uh, comment what I asked you about the uh, look and the if you wanted him to get energy damage as well or not. And uh, I'll be announcing the winner tomorrow, so st uh, stay tuned for that. I'll see you tomorrow, okay? Bye-bye.